Hi, this is Viviki, the composer and sound designer of Arco. And Arco is a unique action tactical game based in a fantastic world called Masitok. And there you will have to explore through vast and different biomes and also you will have to get through different difficult situations in a really cool simultaneous combat system. Um, so right now I'm going to play different music that will appear in the game and I hope you enjoy it.
Hi there, this is Bibiki. I hope you have enjoyed what you have seen so far. And um, I, I wanted to talk a bit about how I try to create this, uh, some identity for Arco. And to do so, the first thing uh, I think you should know is that Arco is split into two game modes. Uh, you have this journey mode where you will have to explore the different locations of the game. You will be able to meet the inhabitants of the world. And then you have this combat mode where you will have to fight against the different enemies of Arco with this cool simultaneous turn-based system. Um, yeah, um, let me show you first a quick look of this track that I want to use as an example. And this track, you will be able to hear it in the game in certain locations. Let's take a quick look. Yeah, so um, to create this song identity, I, I try to create different music materials that I could reuse alongside the music and sound design process. And in terms of instruments, I, I stick mainly with two instruments. Uh, the first one is the acoustic guitar, that you can hear it in this track in many different ways. For example, this mute guitar. Yeah, you have this boat guitar, kind of both sound like a violin. I, I process the, the acoustic guitar to sound this way. Yeah, uh, and this pitch down guitar. Yeah, and this is how it sounds all together. Yeah. Um, the instrument that I think is, is the most important one uh, in, in the music and sound design uh, of Argo is the cajon. Let me show you. The cajon is this little one here, this little guy that is original from Peru, but is also very common uh, here in Spain. Uh, you have this high note and this low note. And you, you can also get a lot of different sounds depending on where you hit it and what do you use to hit it. And in this track I use the cajon in this way. There are several cajones spread in the space and also this uh, sample cajon that I sample myself to, to process it and make it puncture. And also in this track there are a, a, a lot of things going on, like uh, these scenes. Yeah, so crunchy. And um, these claps that are super tight, I recorded them myself. Um, yep. Um, and maybe the most interesting thing about this track is that uh, even though the track is in 4-4, there are some things that are in 3-8 in terms of uh, matter. Um, yeah, uh, for example, this acoustic guitar bass is in 3-8. Yeah, but... Uh, the rest of the things, uh, like the cajon, are in 4-4. Uh, four, four. Yeah, so this is how they sound when we mix them together. Uh, let me show you. Yeah, so even though this track is uh, very static in terms of melody and harmony, I believe that with this uh, polymeter phenomenon, uh, the track uh, gets, you know, more movement. So it, it's a little more interesting. So yeah, uh, this is all. I hope you have uh, learned something interesting about the process of the music and sound design uh, for Argo. Of course, if you have liked what you have seen so far about it, uh, feel free to wishlist the game and enjoy the rest of the show. Bye bye!